mama. Yeah, we're like, uh, yes, they work and slay over here, like, yeah. Oh, Mabel, here's some real girl talk. Only Murders in the Building is finally back in August, along with a lot more on Netflix, Hulu, Disney+, Plus, Prime Video, Max, Paramount+, Plus, Peacock, and Apple TV+. Plus. This is your August 2023 streaming guide. We're kicking off with this month's TV highlights from Netflix. I want you to come out when and how you want to. The beloved LGBTQ romance Heartstopper is back with season two on August 3rd. And on the same day, you can dive right into part two of The Lincoln Lawyer season two. Has the jury reached a verdict? We have, Your Honor. On the 4th, I promise you the super fan of The Bear will be watching reality competition The Big Nailed It Baking Challenge. Gangster, okay. As Nicole and Jacques give 10 bakers the tools they need to go from oh no to pro. Yes, chef. Everybody feeling good? Yeah. The limited series Painkiller explores some of the origins and aftermath of the opioid crisis in America, and it drops on August 10th. On the 11th, you can catch the debut of new film Heart of Stone. Gal Gadot is part of an elite MI6 team, but actually she works for a covert peacekeeping organization. And yep, things get a little messy from there. Speaking of messes, August 16th brings us a three-part documentary series about a court case you probably already watched on TikTok, Depp vs. Heard. But you might prefer to catch new episodes of sitcom The Upshaws, which drops on the 17th. I'm Benny Upshaw. I do what I do. And that's what worries me. I know I'll be hunkering down in my windowless apartment on August 23rd to devour season two of reality series The Ultimatum, Marry or Move On. One person's ready to tie the knot, one isn't. So of course, they swap partners with another couple and all hell breaks loose. Absolutely stunning. I don't even know why I agreed to come do this. And let's wrap the month on the 31st by checking out One Piece, based on Japan's best-selling manga series of all time. I didn't know there were so many pirates. It's terrible. I know, right? Where's my face? Next up is Hulu, which brings us the final season of TV Line fave Reservation Dogs. Well, I ain't headed this way. Metaphorically. Oh! But wait, who killed Paul Rudd? It was definitely you, Meryl Streep, wasn't it? Charles, Oliver, and Mabel are on the case in season three of Only Murders in the Building, starting on August 8th. Oh my God, this is corny. So corny. <laughs> I know it is. Yeah. Murder? Yeah, murder. Yeah. Animated sci-fi sitcom Solar Opposites returns for season four on the 14th. Gah, he's dead! We left him in the car with the windows up! Oh, thank God, he was just sleeping. Forgot how he looks super ugly when he sleeps. Time to talk about Disney Plus, where Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 makes its streaming debut on August 2nd. And we'll kill anyone who gets in our way. No, not kill anyone. Kill a few people. Kill no people. Kill one guy, one stupid guy who no one loves. And brace yourselves for the final season of High School Musical The Musical The Series, which premieres August 9th. Rosario Dawson headlines the latest Star Wars series, Ahsoka, beginning on the 23rd. I see you, Hera and Sabine. Once a rebel, always a rebel. And a couple days later on the 25th, you can try on a new 4K remaster of the animated classic film, Cinderella. Moving over to Amazon's Prime Video. Some people in this town don't like the idea of women running a farm. They don't like that we keep to ourselves and that we're different. What the hell happened out there? The Sigourney Weaver-led limited series premieres on August 4th. Then on the 11th, watch out for the movie adaptation of Casey McQuiston's best-selling novel, Red, White, and Royal Blue. This must be Channing Tatum. Yeah. Do I look like I own tights? This can step up. I don't know. It doesn't matter. And the 18th brings us the freebie rom-com film, Puppy Love, starring Grant Gustin and Lucy Hale. Plus, adorable little doggies. And now, on to Max, where sports fans have a couple of shows to look forward to. You bet. Season two of Winning Time, The Rise of the Lakers Dynasty premieres on August 6th and continues to explore the 1980s Los Angeles Lakers. Plus, the latest edition of Hard Knocks kicks off on August 8th. This season, the NFL series takes us inside the New York Jets training camp, starring Shailene Woodley's ex-boyfriend, quarterback Aaron Rodgers. Meanwhile, season two of comedy series Rap Sh drops on the 10th. Wait, so she got on Gucci and we got on... Aha! <laughs> this is officially racist. Tracy Morgan's Taking It Too Far comedy special arrives on the 17th. My Tinder profile is a Walmart truck dropping off a bag of money on my front lawn. And on the last day of the month, get ready for the latest Adventure Time spinoff, Fiona and Cake, starring a fearless, sword-wielding adventurer and her magical best friend and talking cat named Cake. Ooh, Cake! Over on Paramount Plus, look, I'm gonna keep it 100% profesh, but we are going to miss Hot Spock when Star Trek Strange New Worlds wraps season two on August 10th. Look, I'm gonna keep this like 100% profesh, but I was thoroughly unprepared for how hot young Spock was going to be. Meanwhile, young adult romance, Love in Taipei, premieres on the 10th. And the seventh and final season of Billions starts on August 11th.
We're not waiting to pounce. We're gonna tell you what we're gonna do, and then we're gonna do it. Now let's take a little peek at Peacock, where season three of Kevin Hart's talk show, Heart to Heart, wraps on August 3rd, which turns out to be the same day the Super Mario Brothers movie premieres on the streamer. And Craig Robinson's comedy series, Killing It, returns for season two on August 17th. That was crazy. Do you think I might be repressing some MGO? Yes, Jillian, I do think so. And finally, when it comes to new releases on Apple TV+, the third and final season of Physical now co-stars Zoe Deschanel, and it premieres on August 2nd. Plus, Dan Harmon's Strange Planet adaptation begins on the 9th. Wow, you licked me inside the mouth. This is disgusting, and it's perfect. And season two of sci-fi thriller Invasion kicks off on August 23rd. The answers are here. And those are your August 2023 highlights. Manja, baby. But there's so much more in our streaming guide on TV Line. So go there for more, but first, tell us what you'll be streaming this month in the comments. For TVLine.com, I'm Claire Franken. How did you get this job? I'm really adorable. Oh. <laughs>